Hello everyone, welcome to MS Apti webcast. In this video, we are going to see the steps on how to change a user's display name and primary mail address in Exchange Online using Microsoft 365 Admin Center. Sometimes you need to change a user's display name and primary mail address, for example, if they get married and change their name. In this scenario, you would want all email they send to originate from the new email address, but you would still want them to receive email sent to the old email address. After we change user's username, it automatically creates an alias of the previous username, so you won't miss any emails sent to the old email address. In this video, we want to change user's username and primary email address. For that, we need to access and log into the Microsoft 365 Admin Center. You can access the Microsoft 365 Admin Center using the URL https colon double slash admin.microsoft.com. In the Microsoft 365 Admin Center, click on Active Users. Click on the mailbox for which you want to change the username and primary email address. In this demo, we will change the username and primary email address of our user Riyan Patel. Let me show you that. Okay? Right now, as you can see, our user Riyan Patel's username and primary email address is rianp at clarex.onmicrosoft.com and that we want to change. Let's click on user account. You can also get the same information under account tab. Uh, you can verify that user's username and email address is rianp at clarex.onmicrosoft.com. First, we will change our user Rian Patel's display name. For that, under contact information, we need to click on manage contact information. Change the first name, last name and display name of the user. Instead of Rian, I want to put Vishal. And the surname is going to be Sa. And based on first name and last name, I want to set a user's display name to Vishal Sa. Perfect. Now I'm going to click on save changes. Contact information updated. Uh, perfect. Let's go back. Here we can see under display name. Now we can see the new name Vishal Sa. Next, we will change the user's username and email address. For that, on account tab, under username and email, we need to click on Manage Username and Email. Click on Edit icon to change the primary email address for this user. Let's click here. Enter the email address of your choice which is going to be Vishal S. If you have added custom domain to Microsoft 365, uh, you can choose the domain by using the drop down button. Okay, but in our case we have uh, only one domain which is clarex.onmicrosoft.com. Once you change the primary email address and username for this user, click on done. We can see the primary email address is changed successfully and that is here, visals at clarex.onmicrosoft.com. We can also see that the old primary email address is added as an alias address, so users can still receive messages on the old primary email address. And under aliases, we can confirm that rianp at clarex.onmicrosoft.com is listed. This is the primary email address which we had earlier. Okay? Now I'm going to click on save changes to save the changes. We get the confirmation message that changes saved successfully. Let's go back. And under username and email, now we can see the primary email address and username for this user is visals at clarex.onmicrosoft.com. Let me close it. At this point, we have successfully changed the user's username and primary email address. After changing the user's username and login address, let's access the mailbox of this user with new login address. Let's open new in private window. And let's type the URL https colon double slash outlook.office.com and press enter key. 
enter the new email address or you can see username of that user to sign in. In our case, it is going to be Vishal S at clarex.onmicrosoft.com. Click on next. Enter the password and click on sign in. See, if you want, uh, you can change the user's password as well. And you can tell the password to that new user. Uh, this is going to be your password. And you can also set up that option to change a password at a first sign in. But since this is a taste environment, I know the password and that's why I haven't changed it. Okay. We have successfully accessed the mailbox of our user using the new username, which is Vishal S at clarex.onmicrosoft.com. And we can also see those existing mails inside the mailbox. Okay. Now we want to send a taste message to confirm that the user can receive messages on both email address, the earlier primary email address and the new primary email address. So let's go back to the Microsoft 365 admin center where already I have accessed the mailbox of our administrator Manhar Rakholia using Outlook on the web. Initially, I'll send this message to user's old email address, which is rianp at clarex.onmicrosoft.com. Okay, after composing the message, I'm going to click on send to send the message to user's old primary email address. Let's again click on new message to compose a new message. And this time we will send this message to the new email address. Uh, let me show that is Vishal. I don't see it. Let's try to search Vishal. Okay, here it is. Vishal S at clarex.onmicrosoft.com. Let's click on this plus icon to add as a recipient. Click on save. So I want to send this message to a new primary email address of that user. After composing the message, I'm going to click on a send. Perfect. We have sent two messages, one to old primary email address and the second to new primary email address. Now let's check the mailbox of a user Vishal Patil. Here we can see the user have received both email messages which we have sent on new primary email address and old primary email address. Let me show you that. This is the old one. Uh, we have sent this message to rianp at clarex.onmicrosoft.com and we have sent this message to new primary email address which is vishal s at clarex.onmicrosoft.com. User is receiving both email messages inside his mailbox due to the alias email address. Uh, let me show you that again. Let's click on Visalsa. Let's click on uh, manage username and email. You can see this is his primary email address and this the old primary email address is now added as a alias address. That concludes the video on how to change a username and his primary email address in Exchange Online using Microsoft 365 Admin Center. Thank you all for watching this video. Have a nice day.